Raven Chapman, lovely to see you. Good to see you guys. How are we? Hello. Raven Nick, Nick Raven. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, All good. yeah I, think, I think you're two of the best in the Queensbury stable, to be honest. I think, I think I'm in good company here. Yeah, we'll, we'll yeah. take care of you, Dev. Yeah, worry. thanks. That's good. <laughs> um, the question, the, the sort of default question I always ask after a weigh in mm-hmm. and a face off is what did you see in her eyes? Um, I think she's really enjoying the experience here, to be fair. She seems like she's happy to be here, glad to have the opportunity. Um, and hopefully she gives me a good fight for for my title tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I think, I don't know, I think she, she I don't know if she's experienced weighing like that before. Um, so yeah, it's probably new to her. That's sort of what I felt like I saw. You were at the press conference yesterday. She wasn't here. No. You were here. Yeah. You, you read out a lovely message in Spanish for her, yeah. which was quite friendly. Yeah. She then took it and posted it on across her social media, which I saw, <laughs> and she said thank you very much. Yeah. Are you getting too friendly with her, Raven? No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'm just trying to set, like, uh, you know, an unexpected, so then, you know, I'm all sweet outside the ring, like they say, that's where my nickname put it on, on in, in the ring. Yeah, yeah that's the one. Put it on in the ring, you know, so... Like expect- games. the unex- unexpected, yeah. yeah. Why not? So, um, yeah, no, I just, you know, I, I show my opponent respect, yeah. you know. She's come all the way from Peru to fight me tomorrow night. Yeah, um, she could have easily said no, you know. It was a last-minute um, opponent in. So, like I say, I was just very thankful that I'm still fighting tomorrow. But just on that, uh, about the, the kind of friendliness and the respect in the build-up. Yeah. Um, You've also been for dinner with Amanda Serrano, who yeah. could who could be the the woman that you fight yeah. for a world title for potentially all of the world titles. I said to Nick, "Have you ever been for to dinner with a future opponent?" He's like, "Absolutely <laughs> no, not." not. Yet. So what's the difference here in in, my, in mindset? What 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 you? Why would you not go to dinner with a future opponent? Like? She's probably nicer than me outside the <laughs> ring. <laughs> That's what it is, Dev. Um, and she's probably showing that, but I don't know. Just something I haven't thought about. I'd rather <laughs> go with me mates and people I know. <laughs> sure. uh, first rather than me <laughs> showing I'm going to punch yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think it's probably different when it's like someone like Amanda Serrano for mm-hmm. you know she's one of the top women in the game like from the start whereas in the men's game it's not quite that same sort of thing with it really mm-hmm. you know there isn't that same background to it so I think that's part of it she's a very re- respectful champion yeah. so I wanted to show her respect I didn't expect to actually yeah, go for yeah, Nando's yeah. with her that just ended up being a cool thing that we did and it was nice to sit over dinner with possibly a future opponent and who's a current champion and be able to learn a bit more about her as a boxer but her as a person as well and yeah. the team and and just yeah why not be respectful in that way and I think that's something that Amanda really values um, is respect yeah. like I say she's a respectful champion so if you show her respect she'll show you respect back have you stayed in touch a little bit yeah, yeah not like all the ma- I'm not very good on socials sure. anyway so I barely text my mates back here so uh, um, I try and you know show show love and support when you know when it's suitable and things like that and yeah hopefully you know she did invite us out to New York so maybe we'll take her up on the offer and go out there and we'll have some Puerto Rican food when we're there well look there you go the the invites can I come yeah why not yeah, Dev yeah I'll, I'll come more the merrier thank you you can um, come too Nick if you want yeah, <laughs> yeah. thank you what's coming as well what, what, a, what a day um, <laughs> Raven tell me what's going to happen tomorrow night um, just complete dominance by the omen for sure um <clears throat> I believe I'll get a stoppage tomorrow. I think looking at her, um, obviously short short notice. I, I hear she's been in training, but she won't have been training hard or preparing for someone like me. Um, she's not necessarily a natural featherweight either, so she won't have been in with someone as strong as me. So it will get to a point where I just break her down over the rounds. So first few rounds, figure out. I don't know what she's about. Um, and then, yeah, it's going to be game over from there. Well, there you go. Well, that sounds nice. pretty, sounds yeah. pretty <laughs> ominous, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> um, Raven, thank you so Thanks much for speaking to us. You. I'll grab the mic yeah. off you and. We'll